Well, if you are a beginner and if you want to learn special theory of relativity without going too much into the mathematical complications like differential equations, etc., then I can suggest you this book. Space-Time Physics by Edwin F. Taylor and John A. Willer is just a masterpiece. Well, as you can see, both of them are great physicists, Taylor and Willer. Now, the book, uh, as I found it in Amazon, uh, it has got a great review. The content of the book has got a nice and clear explanation. It has got a lot of space-time diagrams, easy explanation, and most importantly, engaging stories. Now, the speciality of the book is that it will cover everything related to special theory. It will start with the basics of physics, for example, the ether theory, etc., and it will take you to twin paradox, time dilation, length contraction, space-time diagrams, and everything. The best part of the book is that the mathematics that you see is defined in a new way. You won't find those d by dx or uh, Nabla squared or d squared t, all those mathematical complications. But Taylor and Wheeler, the two great masters, have redefined those mathematics in different kind of a language. You will find a lot of engaging stories. You will find the book as unput downable and you will continue the reading the book in the morning and I can assure you by the end of the day you would have finished the book. Now there are certain pros and cons. I told you that it is uh, it doesn't have a too much of a mathematical rigor. It doesn't contain too much mathematical complication but it takes you through a wonderful lovely journey of space-time physics and about special theory but of relativity. Remember that if you are a real mathematical guy and if you're looking Looking for something very deep in mathematics with a lot of derivations and things happening on a mathematical way this is not the book for you the book is basically uh, more philosophical it is a beginner's book and uh, if you're struggling really to understand the counterintuitive concepts of special theory of relativity you should go for this this book I would say I would go five out of five because it takes on the intuitive concept goes a little bit into mathematics but does not leave you confused